What's up guys, Sharky Cello here again, as you guys can see here, I have a Duel and Network Duel. I was gonna do this on Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro, but for some reason Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro was being so gay. But anyway guys, as you guys can see here, I have a shit hand, yay! Nah, but uh, this is me playtesting Worms, and how uh, Worms got a lot freaking better with uh, King Gremlin, oh my god, King Gremlin, uh freaking love that card now um the guy that i'm playing against he's playing a photon a photon <laughs> a photon deck there we go i think i said it right the first time or oh, whatever but he's playing a photon deck and um we have a pretty freaking good duel here even though i drew like shit this guy goes already um gets one of his photon monsters out i don't really what the fuck i really don't know what these photon guys do but uh right here he's gonna summon galaxy eyes photon dragon with Galaxy Knight and uh, Galaxy Knight is pretty freaking good. It makes the deck such 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 You know it gives it consistency and uh, it just you know the deck has a lot of potential with that card um, Too bad. We're not gonna get into the next set, but um, I think it's the next set but the deck has so much potential to be at least a tier 2 deck and uh, Yeah, I can't wait to see it so right here, I'm going to go Poly Duality. Hopefully, I can get any uh, good worm monsters. And, of course, I get Yigen. Um, you know, that's not good enough, though. But uh, as you guys saw there, I took... I mean, before everything happened, before I ended my turn... Um, I mean, before he ended his turn, uh, when he attacked me, I did not... I chose not to use my Mirror Force because uh, if I would have, he would have still attacked me with Galaxy Ice Photon Dragon and activate his effect to just bounce him back and just, you know, kill me. And that's what he was going to do here. So uh, not activating Mirror Force last turn was a very, very, very smart decision on my part. So it allowed me to destroy all his monsters at once, thinking that I don't have any, you know, uh, any good cards on the field. Thinking I just drew a bunch of crap because I set um, Burn Man, which you usually don't set Burn Man unless you have a shit hand. But um, yeah, so right here is going to go into Thrasher and then Satellite, activate uh, Satellite's effect to, go to turn him into a level 4. I mean, a level 5, and then he's going to go into uh, Tyrus, and um, yeah, so he's just going to attack me with it, and then uh, Yagen gets destroyed, and I'm going to activate Yagen's effect to bounce it back, yeah, <laughs> um, but Satellite's really good, it, what Satellite does is that um, uh, whatever the other Photon monster is on the field, it gains that, and then uh, whatever level it is, the other Photon monster it took the levels from also gains the same uh uh, number of levels so they're both five in this situation so right here is gonna go into wizard and wizard uh, allows him to search uh, one of his uh, spell cards uh, one of his galaxy spell cards so right here um, you guys might be wondering why am I playing alien shock trooper in a worm deck um, you guys will see soon enough why I'm playing that <laughs> actually I should tell you right now um, the reason why I'm playing alien shock trooper because you know uh, King Gremlin is just such a such such a freaking good card and it helps the deck out so well um, it just gives you more consistency and then by playing um, Shock Trooper he's a reptile uh, Shock Trooper with rabbit and um, uh, we get a first turn Gremlin activate Gremlin's effect search out any of my reptile monsters in my deck and just uh, proceed to beat down my opponent from there uh, Shock Trooper is also a 1900 beater which is something that worms really need uh, too bad he's not a light type monster. If he was a light type monster, that'd be so amazing because it'll work very well with W, ne w Nebula Meteorite. <laughs> but uh, yeah, so right here is gonna go activate his uh, Galaxy Zero. Um, previously, before all this, uh, he went into his uh, the the big dragon guy. I forgot his name. <laughs> uh, tried to pop two of my cards, but I ended up uh, Starlight Roading him, going to my Stardust which is a pretty freaking good move. So right here, he's going to summon two Galaxy Eyes pro pro Proton, I almost said Proton, Photon Dragons. So he's going to overlay them, and uh, what is he going to go into? I forgot. Um, oh, he's going to go into that Behemoth. That guy is freaking good. I actually um, uh, forgot what he did for a second there, but um, uh, that guy, what he does is that he negates effects. Like uh, when you're going to go into your battle phase, you activate his effect detach and he gets he negates any effects uh, for that turn and if you were to activate a card effect um, you know during the turn he's attacking then uh, he gains a thousand life 
uh, life points. He gains a thousand points. He becomes a freaking huge ass monster. So right here, I'm gonna activate. Uh, I'm gonna flip summon Yigen. I'm gonna go into uh, King Gremlin. Activate Gremlin's effect. And then, uh, of course, you guys can see my deck here. I'm gonna go into an X so I can get uh, pluses. But um, you know, of course, I can't do anything because Gremlin's on the field. Uh, I'm just gonna attack with King Gremlin and uh, just you know. Screw him over. I know they changed his name to King Pharaoh Imp, but uh, I like to say King, King Gremlin better. It sounds it sounds more better. <laughs> so he's gonna um, um, use Monster Reborn to get his Photon Monster. I was right here thinking, uh, did did he use his effect or what is he gonna do? But uh, apparently he didn't use his effect. But um, he just wanted to run it over. <laughs> so uh, right here, I'm gonna go into Evil Dragon Anata and. Uh, King Gremlin can search out e Evil Dragon Anata, which is so, so, so uh, freaking amazing. Uh, you just get a huge ass beat monster for no reason. So right here, I makes um, Evil Dragon Anata 24, uh, attack and defense. So I just end my turn so I can activate his effect to pop his uh, his Photon Dragon. Just go into attack mode, summon Worm X, Worm's X effect activates. Uh, dumping one of my uh, Yigens to the graveyard. Right here, I was uh, seeing if he had any response. I'm gonna dump Yigen to the graveyard and then attack. And uh, I win the game, guys. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Until next time, guys, I'll see you guys later. And uh, tell me what you guys think about this deck. Until next time, guys, I'll see you guys later. Bye.